You see, though, though the final letters are yet uh, to be announced officially, but uh, the indicators state that uh, though BGB could not attain a simple majority, but it's the single largest party. In spite of getting in and around 240 seats, it's a defeat for them. And Congress getting in around 100 seats is a victory for us. Why? Because of the simple reason, we fought for a cause. The cause was to save the constitution of India. And uh, since they could not get uh, that uh, the number of seats which they had targeted since so Sattar 370 and with its allies 400 with an intention to bring in major changes in the constitution to curb the rights of the common uh, people of the country. So it's a grand, grand success for the Congress party which is fighting for a cause along with uh, its constituent partners, the India bloc. So we are very, very happy uh, in that aspect and they are marooned. Marooned in the sense, number one, they couldn't get a simple majority. They have to depend on other partners. If, if at all, they rendered the uh, support and uh, obviously they will be under various pressure from various quarter of the smaller ally partners. And uh, it will be a, uh, not a stable government in the, at the center. So in that aspect, uh, we are very happy that at least the ill intention was understood by the common people. And they have voted for the India bloc uh, for, the, for the cause for which they were fighting, that is to safeguard the, to safeguard the constitution of India. Tripura was completely rigged. The voters were being completely uh, resisted, prohibited to go to the polling booths. There were false voting throughout. The polling agents couldn't reach. And whosoever reached, they were thrown out after an hour or so. So it was a Kula Maidan for them. And uh, they just rigged the elections. And that is why we, we got to the knowledge of the Election Commission of India. And we demanded for a repoll in the entire constituency. And it happened. And the election commission was a silent spectator. So that is why the uh, original mandate of the people of the state was not reflected in the EVMs or the counting of votes. Yeah, it's a it's a it's a very neck-to-neck -neck, uh, contest. And uh, let's see uh, what Mr. Nitish Kumar, uh, Chandrababu Naidu, and uh, other smaller parties had to say. Biju Janata Dal, uh, YSR, these parties had to say. If they come forward and and uh, and Render us uh, support, why not? We can obviously form a government.